Afisa, get to my room and do my shoes. I need to go to the class now. So you left the room just for you to come out here and send me to go and take your shoe. It's high time this nonsense stop. What nonsense? And is this the way you now talk to me in this house? How many times have I told you that when you want to talk to me, talk with respect? I am not your HP. Respect. I'll never respect you so far as father has decided not to send me to school. Everything is all about you. Does it even look like I'm your sister? Hey, uh, I have told you, you are somebody's future wife. Don't no need to even think of going to school. Your role is to stay in the house, cook food and wash dishes. I don't see why you should waste your time thinking about school, 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 school. School is only for guys. You are just good for nothing. Yes, for a blockhead. Yeah, you have been repeating one and the same class for years. Five years now you are still in the same class. You are just too dull. So I think father is the one wasting money on your head. This should be the first and the last time you will ever alter such a thing. I think it's see with you. Ah, me, me, me. Shut up. Ah, me, 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 me. Me. What is happening here? Abdul, Afisa, what is going on in my past? Afisa insulted me and I gave her what she deserved. What? But father... Keep quiet. She even said that if she was in school, she would have performed better than I was. Did you just mention school? I've told you time without number that women in our culture, they are not allowed to go to school. Have you done your house choice this morning? No. To the kitchen. Fast! To the kitchen. And you, why are you sitting here at home? You're supposed to be in school. Yes, ma'am. I was somebody in food. Ha! Huh. Hey, Tafi, education is really important. You can talk to your father about it. I've gone to school and I've known the importance of education, Katsumi. You can talk to your father about it. My friend, you are right. But you know it's very easy to talk about it. But then, you know you are from a different background. And in my culture, it is quite normal for a lady not to go to school. That is why in my house, it's only my elder brother that is being sponsored to school. And me, I understand. But you told me about your father's friend. Why don't you talk about her? Talk to her about her. She can be of help. Yeah, I did. I spoke to her and she promised to come see my father in the time soon. Okay. I have won your time without number. To stay away from that good for nothing girl, and you will never listen. Now you have chosen your path. Show me your hand. And soon will be taken away. No, I'm a woman like your daughter, and I've been to school. Remember that we cannot attend a broader world and emergence Cameroon if we do not put an end to prejudice, discrimination, and gender inequality. Gender inequality has been an inhuman practice ongoing around the world. The Commonwealth has as main objective to abolish this inhuman practice. Reason why I am here today to encourage each and every one of us to put an end to gender inequality. The idea of the woman's place is just in the kitchen must be put to an end. I would like to encourage each and every one of us here, be it the men and the women, let us work hand in glove in order to forge our country ahead. 
long live to Queen Elizabeth, long live to Cameroon, and long live to the Commonwealth.